Hey guys, it's Elaine, the Ninja Life Coach, and welcome to my channel today. Today, I'm gonna to be reviewing Felix by Hair Kitty Kitty in Harlow Blonde Rooted. So sit back, grab yourselves a cup of coffee. I'll be right back. Hey everybody, I'm back. And this is Felix in Harlow Blonde Rooted. Now, this is my second Felix. Most of you have probably seen my review of Felix in Indigo Swirl. This wig feels a little different than my older Felix. This wig does not have as much permatease here on top as the other Felix does. Now, don't get me wrong, this Felix does have some permatease, but not a lot. She's lighter weight, too. She's a lighter wig, and I'm wondering if they've not modified this just a little bit from when they first came out with Felix, but I absolutely love this style. Felix is one of my favorite styles of all time. Now, let me turn around. Let me let you see Felix all the way around. Here we go. Now, I would say that this is definitely a blonde, warm wig. Illuminati is definitely a cooler wig, and the rooting is darker. The rooting on this wig, I'm gonna get in here so you can see this. This wig has got a golden brown rooting on it. So, it looks a little bit more golden. I think this wig would be perfect for the summer. I love this wig. Now, this was a couple of weeks ago, actually the wig of the week with Hair Kitty Kitty, and I purchased this wig at 45% off. They have a wig of the week every week that's 45% off. So that's always a good time to click the link down in the description box and go over there and buy a wig because I got this one, I think with tax and shipping and everything, it was like $62 or something like that. So that's a great time to try Hair Kitty Kitty wigs because they're a great price at that time. And of course, you can always use my coupon code One Brave Woman for 30% off anything else in the store while you're over there looking. But let's look at the specs on this wig and let's see what she's got. Be right back. Okay, I've got her pulled up on the website. She is an average wig cap. She accommodates average to petite to average large when adjusted. She does have the adjustable straps and we'll look at that here in just a minute. She has a 2.5 inch fringe, which is this. The crown is 10 inches. The nape is 4.5, overall 13 inches. She weighs three ounces. And I've got to say, these little beachy waves are just cute. I really like this. Now, compared to Ambrose, this wig is a curlier product than Ambrose and shorter, even than the 10 inch Ambrose. This wig is a little bit shorter than that. Not much, but a little bit. And I do like the way the bangs, they're, they're kind of at an angle here on the side. They kind of go like this. I have not touched the bangs. This is where they, they were when they came right out of the package. And I actually like that because that gives me a little bit of a baby bangs right here and I did not have to cut them. So that's always a plus if I don't have to cut the bangs on my wig because I really, the older I'm getting, the more I just hate to take the scissors to her. I mean, it's just always like, oh, I'm gonna have to style this wig. But this is pretty much the way Felix came right out of the box. Now I've got to say my other Felix in color Indigo Swirl came right out of the box looking great too. I didn't have to do a whole lot to that wig, but just, you know, kind of zhuzh it up on top just a little bit with the permatease and just come and go. And I think this color is just simply gorgeous. Let me get in here and let you all see this really good. And let me turn around again. I do think this wig looks really pretty with a bold pink lipstick. I do think this style lends itself very well to a bolder makeup look. I'm just, I'm just gonna be honest. Now, I may try it one day with something a little bit more nude and natural, but y'all know me, I'm not big on the natural look. I'm just kinda like the Dolly Parton in Steel Magnolia's frame of mind. There is no such thing as natural beauty. So I think that 
when you put some bold makeup on with this wig, it really, really enhances this wig and it makes it just a stunning looking wig. Now, let me take this off and we'll take a look at the wig. Be right back. Okay, I am back. Now, you can see right here are the felted ear tabs and they are bendable, which I love that. That's almost a deal breaker for me anymore if a wig doesn't have bendable ear tabs. And a lot of times on your less expensive wigs, they won't have that. But I've not tried a wig by Hair Kitty Kitty yet that doesn't have those bendable ear tabs. They've all got it, and I love that. And I like that felting on there because that really makes that soft and not scratchy right around your ears. This is a comfort cap, and this is enclosed right here. So it's nice and comfortable on the back of your head if it rubs and if you, you know, have, you know, if you don't have any hair in the back. This is really comfortable on that. Um, this does have the adjustable straps. It's just like a little bra hook right there. And pretty much just your basic wig cap. The rest of the design is just an open weft with elastic. And the wig is comfortable, which is a huge deal for me because if, if a wig isn't uncomfortable, I am not gonna wear it. I'm just gonna tell you. It's gonna be on my head about five minutes and then I'm gonna be, get this thing off my head. <laughs> so here's the cap. Let me style her just a little bit with some headbands and I'll be right back. Now, if you should want to get some of the hair away from your face, you can always put just a little headband like this in here. And that's just easy. It keeps some of it back from your face and puts some of the bulk of it back here. Um, sometimes I do this with my wigs, especially the wigs that are a little curlier. This wig certainly lends itself really well to this look. I mean, it's really, really cute. And I think this is, I think this works really well. Let me do a couple of other things. Be right back. Okay, you can also have fun with Felix by doing something like this. This is nothing more than just a couple of little barrettes that I have put in the side of this wig. And this is just cute. I think it's very youthful. I think it's just a sweet, sweet little look. Now, I did actually try clipping the wig back with a clip. And the wig is just too short to do that. But if I work with it a little bit, it might. Um, you would have to pull all this hair forward like this, bring it back like this, and put your clip in. And it will work like this. Let me show you this, if you wanted to do something like this. But the hair is a little short to be pulling back a lot of it. I don't know that that would work. Let's try it. Well, it is gonna work a little bit. Let's see how, let's see how this does. Let's try it down a little lower. Now, if you wanted to do something like this, you certainly could and move it down a little bit lower if you wanted to have a little bit lower clip down here with Felix. This works. Now, I actually just kind of like Felix just like this. I don't know that she needs anything with her, but I do think this wig is just simply lovely. I think this color is beautiful. I think this Harlow Blonde Rooted is a beautiful, beautiful color. Um, I think this wig is a hit. I will be wearing this wig this summer because she's not excessively heavy at three ounces. I wouldn't call this wig a light density wig, but at only three ounces, I wouldn't necessarily call her a heavy density wig either. And I think these little PC curls are just gorgeous in this wig. I think she would be perfect for summer. If you're looking for a little summer fun wig, I think this would be fun. Now on the Hair Kitty Kitty website, when I am making this video, this Harlow Blonde Rooted is available and she comes in shimmer wood rooted. Of course, the Harlow, Harlow, I can't really say that, Harlow Blonde rooted. She comes in shimmer wood rooted, uh, masala chai rooted. She comes in molten copper rooted, which is a gorgeous color too. Harlow Blonde rooted, um, caramel macchiato rooted, royal velvet rooted, which I think this might be my next color that I get, that royal velvet. I think that's a beautiful color. I've also been wanting to order a peach Bellini wig from Hair Kitty Kitty because I just love that color. I'm just not sure how it's gonna look on me. So anyway, that's enough of my rambling around. I think this is a good buy for the money. 
I think this wig is definitely worth the money. I think the wig is cute. And y'all know Felix is one of my favorite styles. I wear my Indigo Swirl Felix a lot. So now I've got another one to alternate with my Indigo Swirl Felix. So guys, I hope y'all have a wonderful day and a great week. Check out everything I do. It's down in the description box. God bless you all. Maranatha folks. Bye-bye. Love you guys.